Mortars are an indirect fire weapon. It's basically a form of light artillery. With a mortar, you're launching a shell in the air and it lands on top of your enemies. These shells, once fired, take about 20 seconds to land. Mortars and squad are a FOB deployable. Conventional factions can build them for 300 construction currently, and for unconventional factions, it's going to be 250 construction to build these. You can build two per FOB, and each reload of three rounds costs 25 ammo. Maximum range on the mortars is going to be 1,250 meters, and the minimum range is 50 meters. Now, basically these mortars at first glance look to be different, but really in squad there's only one mortar. It's just depending on the faction, the model is different, but the statistics for every mortar and how you use it, it's all the same across the board, so don't worry about the differences, because there are none. It's the same thing with ammo types. Both high explosive and smoke rounds work exactly the same way, it's just what they do when they land that's the only difference between them. Now just to avoid any confusion, since they recently added in the heavy mortar barrage ability for the commander, this is basically just an off-map call-in that the commander can use and is no way related to deployable mortars. I'm not going to be covering how to use that. All the information in this guide is going to be how to use the deployable FOB mortars in squad. If you're using them correctly, mortars can really cripple the enemy. The ability to indirectly fire on top of enemies is great for weakening defenses, suppression, providing area denial, and just creating general chaos on the enemy team. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Now that you know what mortars are, check out the next video and I'll show you how to use them.